Hey guys, uh, so I had somebody come to me uh, today. They had a goal of getting six pack abs and they wanted to do it as fast as possible. Uh, so they just kind of wanted my advice in terms of like, what, how am I gonna break down this problem and help them get to where they wanna go. Uh, and so the first thing, the first thing that I always look for when anybody comes to me with uh, like, I wanna get toned or I wanna change my body composition, the first factor, the most important factor is nutrition. Um, and so like, Every person is a little bit different, but what, what is constant is we need to get to a point of where we have some objective data to know where we're starting from and what the best action step is. So number one, we need to get an in-body scan so we know body fat percentage, lean body mass, and like what kind of changes we're gonna to need to make, like what those numbers actually look like. So if you have 20% body fat, you know, you're looking at at least 5% body fat percentage change before we're gonna be seeing six pack abs. For some people, it takes a little bit longer um, just based on genetics or, or whatnot. Um, but we start with some objective data like that. Okay, then the next thing that we need to do is we need to take the variables out of your nutrition. So like we need to understand what your nutrition looks like. And so like we can take a subjective view on it and go like, oh, I eat pretty good, right? And you go, tell me what pretty good looks like and if it's eating McDonald's and Burger King and you think that's pretty good, like, right? It's not, it's, it's not. So we need to clarify a couple of things on nutrition, make sure that you have an understanding of what we're trying to do. And so like specifically what I'm talking about is like you need to understand that like the role that protein, carbohydrate, and fat play in getting to your goal, right? It's like once we kind of have those narrowed down, then we gotta get in the ballpark of the right balance of those three in order to start making changes. Like for example, if somebody comes in with zero nutrition background or experience in trying to get to their goal, like, we're gonna have some easy pickings to start. If somebody comes in with an advanced knowledge in nutrition, I eat this much protein, I eat this much carbohydrate, I eat this much fat, what you're gonna need is somebody who's got experience in tweaking with those numbers to get to your goal of, of six pack abs. So like, to break it down, to get six pack abs as fast as possible, you change your nutrition, paying attention to your macronutrients, protein, carbs, and fats, and you're gonna want help from somebody who's done it before, otherwise you are gonna spend a lot of time mixing and matching trying to figure out if we don't ever set the tone of, here's a measurable result, here are three variables that could change, here's my body composition now, here's protein, carbs, and fats, and changing with those variables, what you're gonna do is you're gonna find yourself getting frustrated or thinking that you're changing things when maybe things aren't changing in the right direction. Um, it's like with objective data like that, like we have here, we've had thousands of athletes come in here and we've made measurable change in you know, lean body mass, body composition, body fat percentage, like these things are not guesses for us at this point. Like we know exactly what's, not exactly what's gonna happen because everybody's a little bit different, but we know what things we're gonna start with, what's gonna be our second guess, or I should say second guess, but our second option, what's gonna work best after, you know, the first thing, right? And like we just keep moving on the hierarchy to get you where you need to be. Uh, some people it takes a couple, couple steps takes a little bit of time some people you know depending on where you're starting from it's really easy some people it takes a little bit longer but we're always going to start with nutrition in terms of exercise to get the six-pack abs it's not like you need to be doing a ton of core exercises specifically but what you need to be doing is exercising regularly and that's how you're going to get there fastest so main thing is that we don't like you don't go from doing no exercise to i'm doing seven workouts a week uh, what we need to do is make sure that you're you're ramping up according to your current skill level. Um, and all of that takes, in each one of the scenarios that I just kind of played out as hypotheticals, is you need to come in and you meet a coach who's gonna be able to take you from where you're at and give you the next right step to go. Otherwise, you might be going the wrong direction five steps and then realize you just went backwards. Um, and that's the value of a coach is like, hey, I know what the next step is for you. Let's take that one step and it's gonna be specific to you and it's not gonna be super general. It's like, what I'm telling you is, you want six pack abs, first thing you should do, no matter who you are, is like, we need to look at your nutrition, and then second is make sure you're exercising enough. If you want more specific information for you specifically, then you should come and meet with a coach, meet with me, meet with one of our other coaches here, and they're gonna give you the next step specific to you. All right, guys, have a great day. Start with your nutrition, make sure you're exercising. We'll see you soon.